Don't let the noise of others' opinions drown out your own inner voice. And most important, have the courage to follow your heart and intuition. Steve Jobs. Hey, everyone. Welcome to Quotes to Live By. I'm John Timmerman. Steve Jobs coming from us from the heavens, delivering some bombs of value. Listen, this is such an inspirational quote, extremely hard to put into practice. There's so much judging. There's so much comparing, looking to social media of how you should do things, parents telling their kids how they should do things, continuously judging them into adulthood. There's so many pressures, bosses, leaders, coaches telling you you need to do things a certain way. And finding the confidence when in your gut you know it's not the right thing to do to take their advice, finding the confidence to do it anyways is extremely hard because now the thoughts come through your head like they're going to judge me so hard for making this decision. They're going to make fun of me. They're going to be angry with me. They're going to take offense that I didn't listen to them. There's so many factors that will go against it. Steve Jobs is basically saying you need to find the courage to follow your heart and intuition. And some of us are born with that. Some of us can find that. Sometimes you need something traumatic to happen to understand that this is such a valuable thing in life. But wherever you are in life, whether you are, you know, here's a really good example. I've met a handful, uh, more than a handful of people whose parents wanted them to become the traditional doctors and lawyers. You know, this is a, and I don't mean to stereotype, but this is like an immigrant thing in America here. You know, so countries like you know, India, you know, sometimes Asian countries, you know, they come to America to become lawyers and doctors. That's the American dream, you know, or at least it was, right? And these kids, these kids or adults sometimes don't want to do that. They, that's not their passion. But their parents either pay for their way to come over and do it so they feel obligated. They've trained them or, or you know, sculpted them that this is the only profession that they can be in. I, I know actual, I know people, I'm connected with people who are in this actual place in life. And they don't want to. They want to do something else. They want to start their own business, you know, uh, sewing business. They want to, uh, you know, do construction. They want to do th other things with their hands. They want to be creative. And they're so afraid of disappointing their parents. They're so afraid of disappointing or, or being a failure in the eyes of their friends and families and communities that expect them to have this status, this degree. And even if they're successful over here, they're going to be looked at as a failure. And so finding the courage is not an easy thing to do. And, and frankly, I don't have advice for you to find courage other than advice from, from previous podcasts. Uh, Shonda Rhimes, uh, one of our previous podcasts, a quote was basically keep stepping forward, keep moving forward. And in order to find happiness, you need to have progress in life. And if being a doctor or a lawyer is not the progress that you need in your life, you need to go in a different direction. Otherwise, you'll never find it. So to Steve Jobs' credit, finding the courage to follow your heart and intuition is extremely hard to do. But the courageous ones are the winners in life. That doesn't mean they're the ones that are making billions of dollars or building Apple like Steve Jobs did. That just means having the courage to step out and go in a direction that you feel in your gut is needed for you to be happy. If you can find that courage, that is worth the equivalent of building Apple. That is worth the equivalent of billions of dollars. You only have one life. The amount of money that you take to your grave does not rank you anywhere in that life you had. You know what does? Happiness, the way you treat others, and the connections you've made, the impact you've had on other people around you. And if you can't find happiness through your own courage and discovery of what you love, you're never gonna be able to impact other people positively around you. Just a fact. Like and subscribe if this podcast was helpful for you and share it with your friends.